This aircraft carrier is now paradise for divers, but how she sank is not what you think. USS Oriskany, an SX-class carrier, entered service in September of 1950, but only three years later, during an emergency landing of an F-4U Corsair fighter, a bomb flew off the airplane and exploded on the flight deck. But that's not how she sank. Twelve years later, in 1966, Oriskany had one of the worst shipboard fires since World War II, when a seaman accidentally ignited a magnesium flare, but instead of throwing it into the water, in a moment of panic, threw it into the weapons locker where the rest of the flares were kept for storage, which ignited all of them, starting a massive fire that killed 44 men. But that's not how she sank. The ship was repaired and was in service for 10 more years. But as a part of a pilot program, USS Oriskany was the first US warship to become an artificial reef. In May of 2006, 500 pounds of C4 put the ship 210 feet underwater in the Gulf of Mexico. Australia has the Great Barrier Reef and the US has the Great Carrier Reef.